Hey guys and welcome back to our other video, Daily Vlogs of Fences. This morning, um, I just came out a bit earlier but they were a bit too dark. So I just been hanging around and I thought I'll show you around Blackpool. Um, uh, the side streets just up town where people probably don't really go see that much. See what, see them like, anything to see really. So yeah, let's get into the video. So I'm just on Arbor Road at the minute. It's about 8am at the minute of the time of this recording, so you don't get like people going to school or something. I'm um, just walking down like this back street, I think it is, just up Albert Road. Let's see if there's anything down here or something. Right, let's see anything interesting down here. Look like we got um, a business there, the, Law the Lawton. Lord, Lord, I can't get my words out this morning, guys. Oh, that would look like it part of the council. Got a couple of road sweepers there, a couple of council fans and stuff. So, yeah. Have you ever wondered where they didn't keep the road sweepers? That where they miss. Oh, this is a hotel. Open to non registrants public bar, function room, full English breakfast and super fast internet so there you go, you're looking for a hotel with super fast internet the Lawton, Lot Lawton do you say it? Uh, yeah it looked like I'm in between at the back of both of the hotels so it looked like this where all the people park all in vehicles and things like that. But I always wondered where did like the people sometimes you get people who own hotels like living in hotels. So I always did wondered like where do they park them cars? But on the front they're like double yellow lines. So yeah, now I know you learn something new every day. To be fair, I do look quite clean down here. You see those uh, sweet clean is just let's see park on the top so I do then come down here to take the like the carts back and things. Oh, look at this, we got some rip bags here. I think I spoke it too soon. Thing is so you put um, black bags out and things, the birds always come and get them anyway. That's the only problem, but then there's quite a couple of bins down here, to be fair. So, should that really be happening? There's a blue bin over there, you got a couple of green ones there, more mess there. So, should that really be happening? Is it the owners, or is it like, the people who work though, it's just like the registrants when they uh, like, so like, finish now, just go put that around the back. Some clothes and things there. Some more. To be fair, that ain't as messy compared to some of the Blackpool, so I got to admit, that for summer, when the sun out, when the sun out, a nice red sofa. It look like these, this is getting a bit of work done. They've got a couple of um, rubble, I think, then crash that ass down at the bottom here. They look like we got like a little second hand shop here. Or oh, house clearance, yeah. To be fair, I never noticed this little place before. Let me just stand back a bit so you can see. 
Yeah, never noticed this place before. We got a Morrison's Daily there. We got a nice little sandwich stop there. Got an empty, empty shop here. Oh, they dumped the front door being broken before. That line I put it, uh, a piece of board there. But yeah, looked like it used to be a barber's. You can see. Oh yeah, it looked like it used to be a barber's. Got a other shop here. What um, empty? Is it just the ground rent what people can't afford? I don't know what happened with that sink there, I don't know if you can see it, but we got a sink that's hanging out the wall. And then just over the road, we have got the cafe, 103. And this look like it not open also. It, I, it's a shame when you walk down streets, and the streets look quite busy in general. But then you see lots of like shops and things, but like closed down and things. It's sort of the same, really. Just on Hadlock Street now, walking down like the Hadlock um, back alley, I suppose. And just seeing like other place, broken windows. and things like that. Oh, it looked like that window actually coming away from the building right there. Got our other hotel on Reeds Avenue. Got some beds and things in the, in the window. Like not in that like, in the window, but you can see them from the window. When is it getting like all redone? But to be fair, the outside of it actually don't look in too bad shape. To be fair, just came down the other back street and thing. What I'm amazed is. The block of flats, yeah, to be fair, I've been walking like down Meads and all like everywhere. I haven't really noticed this, unless with the front door being at the back, when you walk down Park Road, you don't really realise, but yeah. So, I'm walking down here, and yet again, you got more mess, bridges, and all that. So, um, a, a chair and broken mattresses and all that. It looked like they got a car up being sat there for a while, but it's no number plate on and things. Oh, these are parts where people don't really see. To be fair, I never knew how much like, rubbish under this around the back, like, around the backs of places until like today really what well, I'll, I'll just pop down here see what down here i don't have the little lad with me today i suppose so that always work out a bit better but you can actually see you go down the back alley see you've done open and things where i wouldn't really go down them if i have the lad with me But then you get past a couple of places and then they all look clean. They all look clean, other than having a door there and things, but like people taking pride in them property. Yeah, it's just, do people just give up? Or do they think they don't have time? 
But in this day and age, everything all seems to be a rush. Oh, oh it looked like this one getting all done up. Look like they got some new dolls or something over there. Or less than, or less it just marks on the windows to make them up now. It look like we got all of an empty one here. I'm still in that the same alleyway type thing. And look at this. And this card up being dumped here. You got a couple of smashed windows. The wheel I've got on the front. Yeah. Got the manuals on the back seats so of of it being robbed. Wonder what happening to the church. Is it getting some work done? Was it all fenced up all the way round? Yeah, so I wanted to church getting some work done. Just walking up the same road and look at this. Wonder what happened here. Oh wow. Look like it missing the ceiling at the back and things. Look at that. Let's see if the front door look open. So let's see, can I have a seat right? Can we see right through? Look like they're having a lock on this in the time. Look at that. A bit further up from the one with no windows and things in. You got this hotel where Red Facing is in progress. So yeah. And yet again, they don't look too bad from the outside. So they must not be like ripping everything all out from the inside maybe and redecorating it and new furniture so maybe. Right then guys, I think that is going to be the end of this video. If you want to see a part two, where I go look at some more hotels and things, then let me know down in the comments, and I will go out maybe weekend, is it nice? If you want part two, I'll probably go up that um, near North Pier type of way, up that way, see if there are any like, hotels, like what we've seen today, and I'll walk put down the back alleys and things like that so yeah let me know down in the comments and yeah again as always if you like the video or enjoyed the video then please give it a big thumbs up if you never liked the video then please give it a dislike and if you want to see more videos please subscribe i'll see you on the next one